Good morning from Lung Mabang. I cycled up to the side of the mountain here because there's a home I saw advertised on Facebook for $130 a month for three bedrooms. Not perfect by any means and not in the city center, but just incredible what you can get if you're interested in living here. So let's go see if we can't see the front of the house because I didn't contact the owner. <laughs> the outside looks pretty plain. It could use a little sprucing up, which I'm sure they wouldn't care if you painted yourself. Uh, it's very lenient in loud. You know what I mean? But for 130 bucks, they said they give you a discount if you paid for the year. <laughs> what, what discount? My bung hoon. And put in course and I in a fake book. Put in because he's out here on you. Long nana. You tongue long jump. Man, man, man. More of a poor boy, not gun dog. My bung sister. Team dog malin. What's up guys? I don't want to disturb anybody here at the cafe. It was empty just a second ago, but I do want to show you because the nice part about Lung Kuba in Lao in general is the French left good coffee and good pastries. And this is a cool little cafe outside the city center. Everybody's so obsessed. So obsessed with the city center. They overlook that it's only a few blocks and there's so much more to Lung Kuba. This is a beautiful little cafe outside the city center called Dream Home Coffee. Beautiful little place. I stopped by here because it's really close to where I'm going up the hill. I've been dying to get up the mountains. I've heard there's a temple on top. So let's check it out. Still can't catch in my breath. I feel like I'm gonna have a heat stroke. My goodness. Unfortunately, I'm not gonna make it to the end of this trail, I don't think. It's done like me. But we've only been back on the bike for a few days since we've been back in Tulu. Since we've got to Lung Prabang. And well mostly because the trail is not going up to the top of the beautiful view. Let me show you. And then I'm gonna enjoy riding down some of this, of course. It's about 10, 30, 11. Beautiful day here in Lung Puban. Been out in the sun for a while now. And haven't had any breakfast, which is also unlike me, so. I need some breakfast. Oh yeah, let's get to the top of that hill. And then we'll have a view. Do this. It's gonna be a climb. making my way down, mostly walking. 
This is so steep. If I ride down, I'm just having to squeeze the brakes a lot and I don't want to hit somebody. Like there's people's homes and stuff. It'd be a lot of fun. Look at this. Let's walk down. Yeah, we made it to the bottom of the hill. Got the GoPro on my bike. Should be all right now that we're on paved roads, not just the trail. Some fruit vendors, classic. Fresh fruit, whenever you want. There's always fruit vendors out on the streets. Usually like 10,000 for 15,000 for a piece. So like 50 cents, 40 cents for a few pieces of whatever you're getting or one. Oh snap. We need to go pick up the delivery. I forgot. We are headed over to Hong Alun. Over at Dun Tad Luang. So kind of across the city. Let's go. Made it to now we come market. I need to take a right. One interesting thing about Lungbabang is one of the main roads. Some of the roads don't even have names, so you really have to use landmarks like. I'll be taking you a bunch, I'm sure, over that area. The main road that I, I'd recommend living off of that road, it goes all the way up to the historic zone, passes the big temple. It's right on the last corner is where all the backpacker stuff is and trendy restaurant bar area. Here's Mad Monkey. Backpacker spot. tight and it don't move and filming is not bad at all other times it's a bastard to work with work with me you can get from one point of the city to the other in 15 20 minutes on a bicycle so on a motorcycle even faster and unless you're a big walker which i am you might want to get a bike or a motorbike. If you like walking, I walk all over the city, but it's a couple miles. All right, package secured. 40 cents later, it was sent four o'clock on Thursday. I got here four o'clock on Friday. Unbelievable. Oh, almost lost my bike. Is that a road? Oh, 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 need eggs so bad. Yes, sir, and bananas. The ready man, yeah. Ready man. Hey, how are you? Hey. Get six cents out. Oh, come. Yeah, I'm going to get it. 
Det er en nøgne. Hvor er det? Hvor er det? Maybe we'll just make eggs at home, that's what we'll probably eat the rest of that sausage before. Can't eat it. studying English to kids. I don't know what to expect. Yeah. Easy enough. But it even sounds crazy to me. <laughs> so programmed to have to need a job and all that. So nice to be able to spend my time just on things I find important. I find it interesting. Um, up here there's going to be a place. I can get some stuff. Sure. On the left, once I get to the intersection.
Oh, my van's gone. I haven't seen it move. We made it. Lord have mercy. We've been out there since like 7.30, was it now? 11.30. Time to cook up some eggs, some sausage, avocado, and lots of fruit. I'll see you guys in the next one.